Welcome to Las Vegas for the Skittles Wildberry 200. This is race two of the Affleck Cup Series, season six. And the drivers are ready for a great show. Now, the top storylines heading into race two. Last week's winner, Casey Kane, starts about mid-pack. We'll see what he can do today. Last week's kind of runner-up, Carter Adelman, looks to be dominant this year as he's dominant at the Affleck 200. And then a rookie is on the pole today with Austin Dillon. We'll see how he can do. And then the two hometown kids, Kyle Busch, starts up front. And then Kurt Busch, his brother, starts around 12th or 10th, I forget. Now for the command. Drivers, start your engines. Cars have been fired here, and they roll off Austin Dillon and Kevin Harvick on the front row. Now time for your starting lineup. Row one, we have Austin Dillon and happy Kevin Harvick. In row two, Danica Patrick and Kyle Busch. Row three, Tony Smoke Stewart and Big Brad Keselowski. Row four, the big daddy himself, Jeff Gordon and Clint Boya. Row five, Bryce Harvey and the fan favorite, Dale Jr. Row six, Kurt Busch and Justin Allgaier. Row seven, the man from Minnesota, Carter Adelman, Ryan Newman. Row eight, Gino Harvey, the birthday boy, and Casey Kane. Row nine, Matt Kenseth and Joey Logano. Row ten, Kyle Larson and Carl Edwards. Row eleven, Marcus Ambrose and six-time champ Jimmy Johnson. Row 12, Denny Hammer and Hamlin and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Row 13, David Gilliland and Martin Truex Jr. Row 14, Greg Biffle and Paul Menard. Row 15, Eric Almarola and Brian Vickers. Row 16, Jimmy and Jamie McMurray. And row 17, David Reagan and A.J. Allmendinger. Now, it's time for the green flag here in... The Skittles Wyberry 200. Austin Dillon and Harvick lead him to the green, and Dillon will take the lead off into turn one, and will go through a flyby of the field as they spread out into three wide. Oh, Vickers gets loose up in the turn two. Austin Dillon leads the first lap here in Vegas. Kevin Harvick hot on his tail, trying to get by him. Dillon blocks him as Harvick goes for the lead. He's going to try and pull the crossover. Kevin Harvick working the crossover into one and two. Kyle Busch now giving Dillon and Harvick pressure. Here comes Harvick. Can he complete the pass? No, Dillon gets a swoosh of momentum around the outside. Austin Dillon to the lead once again. Here comes Kyle Busch now trying to chase him down. Junior moving up in the top five. Oh, we got a spin. It's Kenseth, Newman, Hart, and, oh, and Edwards comes in late and takes out Newman again. Hard hit for Ryan Newman. As it looks like somebody got into Kenseth. And it looks as it's Kyle Larson as Kenseth is on the radio yelling at Kyle. Or yelling at his crew chief that he's not happy with Kyle Larson. Larson getting fresh tires after getting loose here. Watch him. Coming to turn. There he is. Yeah, he gets into Kenseth. And then you see him get loose. And then Edwards, nowhere to go. Just splints right in the back of Ryan Newman. Green flag with five laps to go. Dylan and Kyle Busch. Kyle Busch looks like he's going to get a great restart. So is Jeff Gordon. The big daddy himself moving into second place. As the rookie Austin Dillon falls back to third. Kyle Busch leads Jeff Gordon. As go through a flyby of the field. Three wide deep in the pack. They're all fighting for positions. Hungry to get there. Here comes Gordon. They make contact out of four. Gordon and Kyle Busch go back and forth. As Kyle taking the lead once again from Gordon. Gordon led that lap reportedly. And Kyle Busch leads that one. Two laps to go. Here comes Gordon and Busch. Down the back stretch. Here comes Dale Jr. Jr. is going to swoop in and take the lead. The fan favorite. The crowd is on their feet. Rooting for their fan or for their favorite driver. Here comes Junior. Down to the three and four. Makes the pass. And Bush gets loose. And in the Gordon. Dale Jr. wins. The Wildberry Skittles 200. What a finish here in Vegas. It got crazy. Kyle Bush spins. Coming to the checkers. And hits Jeff Gordon. Both still finished third and fourth respectively. Watch this pass by Dale Jr. Makes the pass there. Kyle Bush is going to come back in. As the crowd is chanting for Junior, as Junior swoops down, taking the lead from Kyle Busch. And then Kyle, fighting hard on the outside, just gets loose and boom, right into Jeff Gordon. And the birthday boy comes home with a top five there, as you see Gino Harvey. And then here's the contact between, wow, yeah, that was some pretty major contact between Bush and Gordon. But nothing came out of it, it's just incidental. But Dale Junior wins for the first time since season four. That's got to be a relief for the Junior fans. Good to see June, Junebug back in victory lane, especially in Vegas. And now for your finishing results, first is Dale Jr. 
great finish for him. What a win. Second, great finish for the rookie Austin Dillon. It's going to be a good points day for him. Third is Kyle Busch coming, hoping for the win in his hometown. Uh, Gordon finishes fourth. And the birthday board, G Gino Harvey finishes fifth today. Good job. Beating out Kevin Harvick for that fifth position. And then uh, seventh is Brad Keselowski. Eighth, Bryce Harvey. A really good day for the Magi Motorsports crew, showing strong horsepower as three three of the four drivers finished in the top ten. Tenth today was Danica Patrick, good top ten. Also, Stuart Haas Racing show, showed some strength today. Twelfth, Marcus Ambrose, good finish for him. Thirteenth, Tony Stewart, not bad. Fourteenth is Kurt Busch. See, all four Stuart Haas cars finished in the top 14. That's really good. Rick Hendrick's crew is Jimmy Johnson. As Hendrick, wow, I just noticed this. Hendrick has gone back-to-back -back wins to start the season. That is really good. They're looking strong, just like they are in the Sprint Cup Series. Uh, Joey Logano finishes 19th. Great finish by Biffle today. Finished 18th, especially from where he started. 20th is Eric Amarola. 21st, Jimmy. 22nd, uh, Denny Hamlin. Didn't put his points down. I'll read them to you right now. Denny Hamlin has 18 points. Or no. Denny Hamlin has 25 points. Tied for 26 in points. Uh, Kyle Larson, after getting into Kenseth, finishes 26th. 27th, Martin Truex Jr., um, 28th today was Paul Menard, not having a strong, he, I thought he'd come out stronger, but man, he's been struggling. Uh, 30th, David Reagan, not doing too hot. Uh, 31st, his teammate, David Gillen, and then here's the cars that got in a wreck. 32nd, Ryan Newman. 33rd was Carl Edwards as he slammed to the back of Ryan. And then 34th is Matt Kenseth. And this is JG24, JM26. I hope you like this race. I'm signing out.